Not only does the argument run so deep between the two but one family friend has claimed there will be no quick fix for the pair. While Harry's return to the UK has been seen as the first step in healing relations, the insider warned there is a long road ahead for the royal family. Although the brothers were seen talking following the funeral on Saturday, the insider warned issues can always resurface within the firm. Speaking to people, the insider said, I think it's a good start and it was lovely to see but this whole argument runs so deep, I don't think there is any quick fix. Knowing family, it can mend a bit and then can slip back a bit. There have been ongoing tensions between the Sussexes and the royal family following the tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey. Following Philip's passing, Harry returned to the UK last weekend for the first time since he and Meghan spoke to Oprah. While William and Harry were seen talking after the funeral, it is unclear whether the two resolved any issues between them. Another royal commentator also claimed William and Prince Charles are concerned over talking to Harry amid fears the private conversations may be leaked. At best, royal commentator Phil Dampier claimed the three had only held a brief conversation which is only the first tentative step in trying to repair the relationship. He told The Sun, one of Charles and William's big fears is that whatever discussions they have with Harry are immediately leaked. They will be worried that if they get into any great detail, the next thing they know it will be out in the public domain, which makes it extremely difficult to heal the wounds long term. I doubt if the chat they had was more than tentative first steps in trying to repair their relationships following the Oprah Winfrey interview. But all the same, before they go into greater detail, they will be worried that anything they say will be leaked. Harry and Meghan seem to have everything they could want or need. They have a nice house in California, they've got a son, a daughter on the way, they've got the means of making a lot of money, they've got a platform. So I'm not quite sure what it is that they want, but I would have thought the one thing Harry would want is to repair his relationship with his family. Harry returned to the US this week following the funeral although it has been claimed he did not have a private one-to-one -one with his father. The Duke will return to the UK in July where he will reportedly unveil a statue for Princess Diana at Kensington Palace. The statue will be installed in the sunken garden of Kensington Palace on July 1st, which would have been Diana's 60th birthday. Previously Kensington Palace said, the princes hope that the statue will help all those who visit Kensington Palace to reflect on their mother's life and her legacy. It is unclear whether Harry will return for any family occasions before then, such as the trooping of the colour. The event will not go ahead as usual due to the coronavirus although it has not been confirmed how it will be restructured.